Also, thank you to Champion for sponsoring today's video. Good morning. This is dope. This is great. Uh, oh my God, a squirrel. Hi, editing my coming in. We are so close to 1.6 million subscribers. Like this close. Check if you're subscribed, I guess, and then click subscribe if you haven't because we are this close. I post Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays now, by the way, and then every day in December. Bye, love you. The sun is hitting. Good morning. Hi. Okay. Good morning. Hi. Today, I'm going to take you on a self-care type day. I woke up at 6 a.m. this morning naturally. What? I've done that two days in a row now. I'm so proud of myself. I didn't go on my phone this whole morning. I just decided to like get up and start cleaning because I realized that the time that I'm most productive is when I wake up and I shouldn't go to the gym in the morning because like that's when I have the most energy to get things done. Cause like some people it's at 10 o'clock, some people it's at 2 a.m. You know what I mean? But I realized me, it's like right when I wake up. So I didn't go on my phone. I made some tea and I went on a hike, which was super nice. Cause I've, lately I've been trying to like catch the sunrise and catch the sunset and like be grateful for like you know what i mean i was fucking tired d d d i got like a little juice after the hi sterling and then made some little brekkie cleaned the entire well no not the entire house but i just like reorganized my entire closet i don't know i felt so productive and now it's what time is it me and my apple watch i feel like a nerd it's 11 15 and i'm gonna head to the gym now i usually go to the gym at like 7 a.m so this is definitely different for me but i haven't checked social media today which has been so nice I feel like for a self-care day, we should all try to like not go on our phones because I feel like that's like the most self-care you can do for yourself. But I put a hair mask in and I'm about to hit the gym. I'm excited for today. Today's a good day. Today's a really good day. Today's a good day. He's like my little Pokemon. He follows me everywhere. <laughs> before I go though, I'm gonna eat something because I used to not eat before going to the gym. But lately, I've been trying to eat some sort of like sugar and carbs before I go because it gives me more energy and like I can lift so much heavier whenever I eat something. Throughout this video, you're gonna see me wear Champion and I just wanna say thank you to Champion for sponsoring today's video, which is insane because literally at the beginning of my YouTube channel, I was repping Champion. So it's been like, what? almost five years now. The reverse weave collection of Champion is just unbeatable. You probably know that they have the hoodies, but like, did you know that they have the sweatpants and the shorts? I'm always wearing hoodies in the morning. You guys know this, and especially to the gym. They have the cropped hoodies as well. Which I'm wearing in this video as well. But what I love about the reverse weave collection is the heavyweight material, but it's like not constraining, if that makes any sense. And you can wash it so many times and it'll never get old. It's because it's cut on the cross grain, so it reduces shrinkage. And there's like rib side panels so that there's like ease of movement. I don't know if you can see how this hoodie is just sitting right now. What am I doing? And sweat sets are so trendy right now, especially with fall and winter coming up. You want to be comfy, but still stylish, but still confident. Champions got you. You know, sometimes when you're wearing shorts, they just don't look cute, especially like sweat shorts. It just like doesn't shape you very well. Not with Champion. Do you see the way that this is flaring out right now? How it's fitting, the cut of it, the length of it? Champion's new initiative is be your own champion, but that doesn't mean just winning in sports. That also means being confident in your own skin and just being true to yourself. And y'all know that that's like basically what I live by. I again just want to thank Champion for sponsoring today's video. All thanks to you guys. Bro, why did that take so long to open? Booty? Cheers!
Oh, rice krispie? Mmm. Yo, why does this make my jaw crack? Why are these so good? Oh my god, I just spilled tea all over my tea. I spilled the motherfucking tea. Oh my god, look at me cleaning up the mess that I made right when I make it instead of leaving it. I know that sounds so fed up, but like me two months ago would have left this spill until later to clean it up. And that's on self improvement. This rice krispie, I can literally hear my jaw moving. Is that normal? I'm so excited for today. If you have been busy or you feel so overwhelmed and stuff like that lately, do a self-care day. Like literally take a day to not go on your phone. To me, not going on my phone is like relaxing to me, but it's just a habit of me to like go on my phone 24 seven because I have nothing better to do. And it's just like, I go on my phone, but like it literally does nothing to me. I mean, not nothing to me. It does nothing for but me. But like, I notice if I don't go on my phone, I'm just so much more like fulfilled. Cheers. Oh my God. my teeth are tingling. I always feel like giving up at the last rep. I mean, that's how you know it's the right weight, is when the last rep feels like you can't even f***ing do it, but you do it. And when I tell you, like lately I've been trying to push myself in the gym, I'm pushing, I'm pushing. Anyways, cute little clip. shower I've ever had in my entire life. It's not even the shower itself. I know I sound crazy because I keep like just like talking about some voodoo sh but like I that was the best like workout. Okay I didn't lift as heavy as weights as I usually do. Like I was weak as hell today like but I felt my muscles burning like crazy and I literally could feel my bones like cracking my muscles like tearing like I could feel it so much today and then I stretched afterwards for like 20 minutes which I usually don't do for that long but it's because I could like feel my body it was so weird I think it's because I was being so mindful today because I wasn't on my phone and I could just feel every like inch of my body moving and cracking and like bursting <laughs> And then I took a shower and it just felt so nice. Like I was scrubbing my hair, washing my body. I didn't do anything different. It just felt so good. Like the water hitting my body. Yo, I know I sound nuts right now. Wow, today is a good day. I didn't realize how much being mindful could like affect me. Ah! Today is a good day. Today is a good day. Today is a good day. I literally told myself this morning, today is a good day. I looked at myself in the mirror and I was like, today is a good day. And you know what? Today is a good day. Because I'm doing the same shit that I do all the time. Like nothing has changed. I just, I'm trying to like be more grateful today. I love life, life is great. I'm literally gonna pee my pants. Oh. Shirley, one more. Okay, good boy, good boy. You're such a good boy. Treat, treat. Basically, Sterling's teeth. I haven't been taking care of it. I haven't brushed his teeth in so long. I get his teeth brushed whenever he gets groomed, but and his teeth has like gross buildup on it now, and I don't want him to be like 13 years old and have teeth that are broken. I decided to start taking care of his teeth. I gotta treat him good so that he lives long. Okay, we're currently in my closet. I finally like organized this room. This morning I woke up at 6 a.m. Organized this entire thing. Like I vacuum, put a rug in it. Like it didn't look like this this morning. Oh my God, why is my voice so shaky? What the fuck? Wait, hold on. Can we talk about the booty gains? We all know that I used to have a flatty, but I've been consistent with the gym. Sheesh, okay, okay. Boom, all of a sudden, I'm changed. This whole fit is also from Champion. 
<sighs> okay, so instead of making another breakfast, I thought I would just meal prep a bunch of salmon and eat salmon. <sighs> Why am I so shaky? Yo, I'm like experiencing something really weird right now. I was talking on my spam account last night and I was like, how can I make you guys feel like I care about you? I want you to feel like when you watch my videos, it's like we're family, you know what I mean? Like, or we're best friends. And I'm like, how can I show you that I care? And came I came up with this idea where I'm like gonna open a PO box. You guys can send me stuff if you'd like, send me letters, doesn't have to be packages. Every like other week or just every week, I wanna sit down, make some food or order some food. Just open your guys' packages and talk to you guys. And just talk about life. FaceTime like three of you guys and see if you guys have any questions for me. And we'll just talk, you know, and like make it basically like kind of like a podcast vibe or like we're just hanging out. It'll be like a pretty unedited video, but like it'll be like 30 minutes long and it's just gonna be us talking. Just so I could catch up with you guys and just like get to know you guys more. Like my favorite part of YouTube is reading my comments and talking to people. I read like almost every single one of my comments. I value your opinion so much. Let me know if you like my content now. I don't know if you like my content now. Let me know. God, I need to take a picture. Wow. <sighs> Finally finished making food. I'm actually gonna eat now. I'm gonna make the shrimp like later tonight when I get home. Just because I have something to do. But I'm so excited to have meals ready in the fridge because I feel like a lot of the times I'm like rushing out the door and I don't eat. I just grab like a protein drink. But this will be super nice. Yo, I don't know if I'm mistaking happiness for anxiousness. <laughs> anxiousness. Yo, I like don't want to talk about it because y'all gonna think I'm crazy, but I think I can feel somebody's anxiousness. I never get anxious, but all of a sudden once I send this one text that like I'm not nervous about, like I know I've been gonna send this text, but now I'm anxious. But like my brain isn't anxious, it's my body. Like my physical body literally will not stop like shaking. Like when I was cooking, I was like, what is going on? And I was like being so clumsy and like my voice is shaky, but like I'm not actually anxious myself, it's my body and I'm like, what is going on? This makes no sense because like I got all of my energy out at the gym and I'm like, Am I? I don't know. Call me crazy. So I'm gonna journal because I don't know what is going on with my body right now, but I literally never shake. All of a sudden today, I'm sh shaking. Does this happen to you? Tell me. Do you shake whenever you're anxious? I just spent like 10 minutes, 20 minutes watering my plants. I do it maybe like once every two weeks. Probably should do it more often, but. Thank you to Champion for sponsoring this video. If you don't have friends, that's okay. Because listen, I go through phases, okay? You know when you go through phases and you're like, ugh, like I cannot be hanging out with anybody right now. Like if you feel like nobody is hitting, it's probably because you yourself is drained and uh,